Welcome back to my channel. So today we're gonna, I guess, attempt to go ahead and head over to Costco. Um, we haven't been to Costco. I was just talking to my husband about it. I was like, since seven months since we've been here in Tucson. First off, can you imagine it's been, been seven months? Um, we've only been twice. And this is the first time we're going to Costco since the whole like Corona situation. I know we both have to wear a mask. Um, in there that's a requirement we're gonna go ahead and go shopping um, we still have our $300 gift card from when we bought our vehicle if you guys remember back I was gonna use it one time and then I forgot it at home so we still have it um, I would normally like to stay within the 150 175 range which would leave us the gift card the rest of it for next month um but i know that there's a lot of stuff that we want to pick up so i don't know let's see how much <laughs> how much we end up spending um but we're gonna get ready and head on over don't forget to subscribe if you guys are new masked up ready to go let's go into costco need a toilet come to Costco <laughs> I was just gonna say that looks really cool look how affordable these are $29.99 for that yeah yeah that's exactly what I'm thinking this huge mat this is a 30 by 47 five dollars off right now $9.99 So if you guys can hear me, this is actually new. It's right next to where it's like the chicken tacos. And it is um, kind of like rotisserie chicken with noodles and it has teriyaki. It's like a stir fry. So keep your eyes out for that if you like it. These are really good. to the card to put the stuff in and the mat that we ended up getting I wouldn't recommend because it's already busting so we're actually just gonna take this back right now okay you guys so we are back home we actually started putting the stuff away at the outdoor freezer so I'm gonna show you guys that and then take you guys inside I'll tell you guys the total <laughs> and everything and then um, show you guys the items that are inside so first things right here, you guys saw that we picked this up. I showed it while we're in Costco, $29.99. It's an amazing price. Don't forget to check out Costco when it comes to lighting. So we picked that up. And then we did go ahead and grab these. I think there's 40 patties. Of, yeah, 40 individual patties um, for hamburgers. Seeing how it's summertime, we can go ahead and grill these up. We also did get two bags of a frozen chicken. Um, this is stuff that I always buy. It's 10 pounds Tyson boneless skinless chicken breast um, for under $20. So that's actually what we do. Two packs, so 20 pounds of chicken, I've said this in so many other videos, will usually last us all month long. And then we did go ahead and pick up some of these as shrimp because we do like to cook as shrimp tacos. Um, these are raw, tails on, and they are deveined, and it's 31 to 40. So we got a pack of that. And now let's go inside. Okay, so first things first, obviously we always get the pack of toilet paper there. Kirkland brand is just as good as any other brand. 
Um, that's the one that we usually buy. And then I did want to go ahead and make a note of this because this is the first time that I have seen this um, brand there and this small of a pack. They did have the Kirkland really big packs that they usually sell, but then they had a lot of these and they had this size in toilet paper as well. Um, so I think they're just trying to accommodate and bring in as much as they can just because everything was selling out. So right now they have the options, which I think is really good. Um, we have paper towels already, but I just wanted to pick up another six pack just in case, just to have. So we went ahead and grabbed that. Kirkland trash bags for the kitchen. Um, we bought these, I mean, ever since we've owned a house pretty much. Um, since 2003 stand by these love them we have some pretzels right here these were actually on sale i will have the price of everything popping up on the screen um we love these pretzels they're just different than the regular pretzels that we always get this is a new buy for us this ratio crunch bar toasted almonds um, my husband will try these. I will let you guys know how they are. I will show you guys. The carb count is really low. Um, it's a grab and go type of thing. They were a little bit pricey for 16 bars, but if he likes them, then it is totally worth it. Also gluten free. There you go. Grab some almonds. These are always good just to put in oatmeal. Also good just to grab and have as a snack. Um, energy drinks were actually on sale too. I think they're $8 off. So if you're going to be getting any energy drinks, um, right now is the time to go ahead and buy them. I believe this was 26 and then the black ones, which is the max one was 30, 34, I think. 34, extra the extra strength. There you go. <laughs> max. <laughs> and then, then we got a little thing of ground beef. Do you need beef? Do you need beef in your life, people? <laughs> so I'm actually gonna take this. This is the first time that we've ever bought like one like this. So I'm gonna take it, obviously cut it up and freeze it in separate little sections because God forbid if I froze it like this. <laughs> but just to give you guys a little price point right here, 32.31 um, for almost 10 pounds of beef. There you go, people. <laughs> Okay, let's talk margarita mix. Right here is really, really good. Um, it's affordable. You get two of them. And honestly, we kind of, we prefer this over the Jose Cuervo, right? Mm -hmm. Yeah, so um, my husband makes an awesome margarita. We actually have a video on how he makes it. I will try and remember to link it down below, um, but definitely a must. And then I showed this in my video too, and this is citrus scent, which I love citrus scent. Um, we needed more dish soap, so we're gonna try this. I will let you guys know how it goes. Um, kind of stands, to see if it stands up against Dawn, because Dawn is actually my favorite. We needed more hand soap, so we got a pack of that. We got these um, beef jerky sticks. They are individually wrapped um 50 calories five grams protein zero sugar and no carbs so this is awesome um 100 grass-fed for those of you guys that are interested in stuff like that uh, i would highly suggest these i believe 14.99 and then this is also a new purchase and i'm actually really really interested in trying these i've seen these on instagram on like the um Costco girls that just do Costco stuff and everybody has been raving about these so it's one carb It's all cheese, but you could like wrap it. You could cook it. You could melt it um, There's so many things that you could do with this and I am just like really really interested to see so you could crisp it melt it roll it everything so i will let you guys know on these how they are and then we got this sandwich meat we've been eating a lot of sandwiches lately um kirkland brand chicken breast ham and roast beef so i just felt like this kind of changes it up from the regular turkey that we get all the time so we grabbed that my husband is assisting me <laughs> and then we have this cooked bacon um we've kind of just started buying this 
Um, this is the first time that we've bought this over at Costco, but it kind of just makes for really fast BLTs. Um, I can cut this up because since it's fully cooked and put it inside salads. So there's many options for this. Um, 48 to 50 sticks of bacon, and I believe it was under $10. I think it was $9.99. So um, definitely um, something that I will keep you guys posted if that's going to be a repurchase in the future. And then I think we got two more things right here. These cheese crisps are really good. My husband likes them. Um, these ones are actually comes in two flavors, Parmesan and then just cheddar cheese. 14 bags in here. I will show you guys the calorie, carb count. Um, so these are really good as an option. Um, if you're watching it and just want something like crunchy, I would have to say that's what my husband's one thing is a lot of stuff is soft and so he wants that crunch. And so these are perfect um, so he can go ahead and get that crunch whether it's with the almonds, peanuts, um, or stuff like this. So, and then as you guys know, if you guys have been following me for a while, this is a repurchase. I will stand by this 100%. This chicken kind of taco thing, it has cabbage, it has limes, has a salsa, it has a cilantro kind of like crema. <laughs> it has tortillas, it has cheese back there, and then it has the chicken. Um, it is a little bit on the pricier side, $15.65 around there. These are chicken street tacos, but this is very deceiving because the first time we bought this, we were like, there's no way that that's going to feed all four of us. Well, it ended up lasting us for two days. So it definitely comes with enough. I would say if you guys are eating a lot of tacos, um, it would definitely feed a family of four, at least for one full meal. If you guys are just grabbing a couple tacos, each and you guys have rice and beans on the side um, then this definitely could last you for possibly dinner and then also a lunch so definitely this has been a repurchase a couple times now and we love them so i just wanted to update you guys really fast on these my husband absolutely loved these and they have a little bit of cinnamon in it so he said the cinnamon like little slight taste is what really kind of no miles <laughs> went over the top um, and I asked him, compared these to the Nature Valley, like the honey and oats, and he said, hands down these. So there you go. He loved them. And I will give you guys a glimpse really fast again on all the counts, but this was a go. Okay, so now we are going to talk about price. <laughs> so as you guys know, I had a $300 gift card, and so we ended up spending a total of $357.56. We did end up returning the mat, which was a return of $10.80. So all in all, I think it was a really good trip. Um, and we got so much more than what we were expecting. So that's always a plus. Definitely subscribe if you guys are new and let me know down below if you guys have any recommendations on anything that I should be trying and we'll see you guys in the next one. Bye you guys.